Um, hello friends, uh, my name is Dr. Sunil Bhatt. I am the Director and Head of Periodic Hematology Oncology and Bone Marrow Transplantation at the Narayan Health City, Bangalore. Now today I am going to be talking to you, uh, in fact sharing a success story with you about this little angel called Amira. Amira was like any other healthy kid, but unfortunately was diagnosed um, in her second year of her life with a condition called as mucopolysaccharosis type 1. Now this is a genetic condition wherein your body doesn't make an enzyme and because of the deficiency of that enzyme, the children develop skeletal, musculoskeletal, bony abnormalities, eye problems, um, brain problems, hearing problems and usually they progress um, quite quite significantly and most of the children usually do not live more than uh, you know a second decade of life. Now one of the treatment options for this condition is bone marrow transplant. So Amira's family contacted me a few months ago that um, they wanted to attempt and cure their daughter with this condition which is a which is quite a significant uh, problem genetic problem. Now, bone marrow transplant is of course one of the treatment curative options for this condition but unfortunately Amira was a single child and didn't have any other sibling to donate for them. She also didn't have any unrelated donors who were completely matched with her and hence we chose to use one of the family, one of the parents as a donor who were half matches with her and she underwent an haplotical transplantation with one of the parents as a donor with a new technique called as uh, TCR alpha beta and CD45 RA depletion. Now she has had this treatment few months ago. I'm very happy with to see her progress. She has gained height, uh, she has gained weight and her uh, bony deformities have slightly improved over a period of time. And more importantly, the enzyme she was having deficiency in has started coming back into the normal levels. So uh, the message I want to convey here is that some of these genetic conditions like mucopolysaccharidosis and others, um, although they are not a direct blood or a bone marrow related problem, but they can still be cured with a bone marrow or a stem cell transplant. That's number one. And number two, if you do not have a full match on the family, we can still offer cure to these children using one of the parents as a half match donor transplant. They're possible and feasible in today's date. Thank you very much. Well, hello, uh, my name is Sikandar Bakht. I am from Karachi, from Pakistan. I'm married to Sadaf Khan, she's from India. My daughter is also Indian national. And here I had the opportunity to uh, speak about my journey regarding my daughter's uh, illness that was diagnosed back in February 2022. And it took us not only by surprise, but it was a huge shock. Everything was going well and suddenly the whole uh, world changed. Um, today, as I sit here in uh, Mazandar Shaw Medical Center, um, I do feel very satisfied and I do feel very relieved to a huge extent after the kind of uh, care and service that has been provided towards my daughter, not just as, as a patient of MPS type 1, but also the, the personal attention that has been given over here. If I just look back, because we are in, in July at the moment, end of July, uh, the months that have gone by have been a lot of, uh, there's been a lot of tests mental, emotional, uh, and it is part of that journey. And so for, for those people who, who are starting it or for those people who probably will see it in future, uh, don't, don't give up hope. And there's a lot of good service available around the world, especially when you talk about India and Bangalore. Uh, some top-notch doctors are available and they are so eager and ready uh, to help you, to support you, and to provide you the right uh, guidance. So what we did was, I went to a couple of hospitals, uh, in fact, three, four doctors in Hyderabad itself. And after that, uh, we decided that I should try and take a chance and come. So in March, I think March 7th, I came to Bangalore and I met up with Dr. Sunil Bhatt. Um, and uh, after that, again, I was like, okay, someone else told me because we were also researching. We didn't know anything. So we were more. Uh, trying to find out, who, like reading up and seeing the testimonials, looking up at YouTube, trying to figure out what this disorder is, also trying to figure out what are the treatments all worldwide. So we, uh, my sister and my husband were looking at uh, US, Canada, UK, etc. And I was looking at India itself, because in Pakistan they said that India is the best place that we can get this treated. And Dr. Sunil Bhatt stands in the topmost people who have been doing BMTs for children. So I was more concerned 
streamlining who has done this particular disorder MPS and then I figured out and I could I found out that Dr. Sunil Bhatt has done actually 25 of MPS uh, patients and they all mostly have been successful. Um, my recommendation to the parents and uh, everyone who come across any rare disorder or anything related to cancer etc. Mazumdar Shaw Hospital in Bangalore is the place Dr. Sunil Bhatt and his team is brilliant and even the international unit, any assistance internationally and I have seen various patients coming from Africa, from Oman, from UAE, um, even in India right from Kolkata, they are handling everybody very very well. Um, you are in safe hands. I have been very uh, very happy with the results and successful. You will be able to see how my daughter was before and how she was after after the treatment and I'm very very happy everything was taken care of everything went very smooth the journey was smooth so in the end here your child is not a subject your child is uh, treated with the name they take care special care of them they make friends with your with your with your child they make sure that the child doesn't feel he or she is in a hospital It's a friendly very friendly environment and top-notch treatment thank you very much and, and best of luck